Hey boys and girls, Catfish Terry here. Get the little small fries around. I'm gonna read y'all a little story, boys and girls. On this Christmas Eve night. The words might be a little different. It might be a little like Catfish Terry style, but we'll get through it, y'all. Just bear with me. I'm not a story reader. Was the night before Christmas and all through the house. Not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings was hung by the chimney with care in hopes that old St. Nicholas would be there. The children was all nestled and snug in their beds while visions of sugar bumps danced in their heads. And mama in her kerchief, and I in my cap, had just settled our brains for a long winter nap. When out on the lawn there rose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters, and threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave a luster on a midday objects below. When what to my wondering eyes did appear but a miniature sleigh and eight tiny reindeers. With a little old driver so lively and quick I knew in the moment it must have been St. Nick more rapid than eagles they came and he whistled and shouted and called them by name now dasher now dancer now prancer now vixen on comic on cupid donner and blixen to the top of the porch to the top of the wall now dash away dash away dash away y'all as leaves that before the wild hurricane fly when they meet with an obstacle mounted to the sky. So up to the housetop, the egg flew with the sleigh full of toys and St. Nicholas too. And then in a twinkle I heard on the roof the prancing and pawing of each little hoof. As I drew in my head and was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bow. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot, and his clothes was all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opening his pack. His eyes how they twinkled, his dimples how merry. His cheeks was like roses, his nose was like a cherry. He drawled, his little mouth was drawled up like a bow. And the beard on his chin was as white as the snow. The stump of his pipe he held tight in his teeth and the smoking circled his head like a reef. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed just like a bowl full of jelly. He was chubby, chubby and plump, a right jolly O.F. and laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eyes and a twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but when he went straight to work, and when he filled all the stockings, then turned with a jerk, and laying his finger aside his nose, and giving a nod up the chimney he rose. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle, and away they flew, like down of a thristle. But I heard him exclaim, 
and he drove out of sight. Happy Christmas to all, and all a good night. Yo, Catfish Terry here. And I want to just wish everyone a Merry Christmas. I want to thank everybody for an awesome year. And I hope everybody New Year will be as great as y'all have made for me from the bottom of my heart. I love every one of y'all. And I hope y'all have an awesome Christmas. Christmas in the morning, y'all. From me and Catfish Bailey, we love y'all. Have a good night. Love everyone. Peace on earth, y'all. Take care. Merry Christmas. And Happy New Year.